Hey guys, I uh, just wanted to check in and give you kind of a progress report um, of the testing of my new limited edition Valentine candle with my new glassware. Um, it's the Moulin Rouge glassware. Um, yeah, so this candle has been burning for just a little over five hours and uh, it has already exceeded every expectation. Um, it is just performing beautifully. Uh, let's talk about the melt pool. Uh, the melt pool is a full melt pool, which is where it should be at this point. Um, it's actually had a full melt pool for um, probably since about hour, between hour two and three. Uh, so um, definitely everything is checks out good with that. Uh, the wicks, the wicks are performing beautifully. They are very uh, still for the most part. Um, you know, not bouncing around and all that. Uh, definitely no soot or smoking. Certainly don't want any of that. Um, the fragrance, oh gosh. I mean, don't don't even get me started with the fragrance. It's, it's beautiful. Um, I mean, this, this candle... Um, has already filled up my whole room. It started filling up my room uh, shortly after I lit it uh, and the room next to it. And that's only after curing overnight. Um, generally, you know, the rule of thumb is you kind of want to let a candle cure for at least a week most of the time before you start burning it just to kind of get that maximum hot throw. Um, and, and this is just curing overnight. I can only imagine uh, if it had cured for the proper time, uh, how, how great it would be. Um, yeah, so this, this is the best candle I have ever made, really. Um, I'm going to go ahead and continue to burn it um, throughout the night until I go to bed tonight. Uh, now, just a quick note. Uh, generally, it is not recommended that you burn a candle for longer than four hours at the time. I am doing this just for testing purposes only. I kind of want to push the candle uh, to the max, um, you know, just to make sure that uh, everything goes good because you're always going to have people that do not follow the guidelines that, you know, they're going to light the candle in the morning and forget about it and leave it all day with, you know, unsupervised and you're not supposed to do that, but people do it. Uh, so that's why I just kind of want to do the full maximum uh, testing on this candle to make sure um, that it will hold through the, the 12 plus hour nonstop burning. And I can already tell you that it is going to pass. Um, it is, uh, like I said, it's already exceeded every expectation uh, that I had for it. So I highly recommend this candle. Don't miss out on it, folks. Get it while it's available. And I will be posting my second Valentine candle tomorrow. It's my new, uh, soy wax, um, Valentine edition candle. So, um, that will be featured tomorrow. So be on the lookout for it. Thanks guys.